myself and nine link leaders who really ran the whole day. And those nine link leaders really, really had an opportunity to shine that day. They did a great job. Um, we had an opening ceremony kind of thing where we revisited some of the messages we gave the freshmen about the first day. Are they investing their time wisely? Are they, you know, breaking away from their bungee buddies? So we revisited some of that messaging. From there, they broke off into three different stations. The one station was with Jim in the main gym, um, and he walked the kids through some different link crew type activities. Um, then in the aux gym, I had the students work on a spaghetti challenge. And the students received 20 sticks of spaghetti, um, I can't remember, and one marshmallow, and tape and string. And they had to build the highest tower they possibly could. They had a set amount of time, and the only stipulation was at the end of the time, the height of the marshmallow, that was the height of their tower. Been walking around and listening to some of the groups, you could really hear them um, talking about mistakes they made and how, if they had an opportunity to do it again, what they would do differently. So, and then kind of relating that, not just to spaghettis, spaghetti and marshmallows, but how they can take that lesson and apply it in the classroom. And the third station was up in the classrooms and the kids were actually with link leaders, not necessarily their link leader, but a link leader. Um, and it was 20 freshmen to one link leader. And that's not ideal numbers, but the teachers that were kind of just walking the halls up there to make sure everything was going okay, spoke so highly of the link leaders. They said they handled everything wonderfully. Um, the kids up there took a survey about link crew, their first days, what they're thinking of high school so far. It was a really uh, fun day. Uh, I think a lot of the kids did have a good time. Um, the survey, we had some pretty um, interesting responses that they are enjoying having link leaders, kind of helping them through. Um, and the, one of the cool and interesting pieces of feedback that we got was that um, it felt like a big brother or big sister, not so much like the kids were being babied, but just kind of like helping them through, guiding them through instead of telling them this is what you need to do. They're just kind of guiding them saying, here's what my experience was. You take from that what you want and kind of you know make your own decision. So I thought that was a pretty positive piece of feedback that we received. And I think it's the same exact instruction. But when it, at the end of the day, when you wrote another paper, everybody had something different. Isn't that kind of weird, like how life works that? Works out like that sometimes too. It's kind of like what? You get the same general set of instructions, you come to school, we tell you to do these things, but you all end up being a little bit different, a little bit unique. But at the same time, isn't that cool? Isn't that what makes school a pretty cool place, a pretty cool place to be? Everyone's a little bit different. Look around, you guys are all pretty different. Just like you have different snowflakes that you create. And that's what makes Capital Horseshoe a pretty awesome place. The diversity that we have here, and everyone's different talents, different traits, all those different things. It makes it a pretty special place to be.